Need a little help. Let's open it. All right, so Coming it is in. open. Don't shoot, okay? Yeah, cause we uh, got a lot of guns in America. You gotta see that anywhere you go. Don't shoot, okay? Got too many guns in America. Ah! Hello? I'm not an intruder. Or one oh. of them. Or one of them. Are you being racist, sir? These people might be Are you being racist against you. white people, white zombies? Oh, coloring book. Nice. These crayons are poorly made. Face for Damn. Darn it. Maybe there's something on there. Three new messages. Message one left at 5.43 p.m. Hey, Sandra. This is Diana. We're still in Savannah. Uh, Ed had a little incident with some crazy guy near the hotel, so we had to get him back to the ER and have it checked out. Anyway, he's not feeling well enough to drive back tonight, so we're staying an extra day. Thanks so much for looking after Clementine, and I promise we'll be back in time before the spring break. Message 2. Left at 11.19 p.m. Oh my god, finally. I don't know if you tried to reach us. All, all the calls are getting dropped. They're not letting us leave and aren't telling us anything about Atlanta. Please, please, just leave the city and take Clementine with you back to Marietta. I've, I've got to get back to the hospital. Please let me know that you're safe. Message 3, left at 6.51 a.m. Clementine, baby, if you can hear this, call the police. This is 9 -1 -1. We love you. We love you. We love you. So somber. Uh, so heartfelt, you know, you feel bad for him. You feel bad knowing what probably happened to them. Hello? You need to be quiet. Nam, who is this? Are you okay? Are you okay? I'm okay. They tried to get me. But I'm hiding until my parents come home. What's your name? What's your name? I'm Clementine. This is my house. Hi, Clementine. I'm Lee. How old are you? Eight. And you're all alone? Yes. I don't know where anybody is. How old are you? I'm, uh, 37. <laughs> okay. 37. Where are your parents? They took a trip and left me with Sandra. They're in Savannah, I think. Where the boats are? Uh, in Africa. Where are you? Where are you? I'm outside in my treehouse. They can't get in. That's smart. See? Can you see me? Hey, Clementine, what's window. up? Hi there. She's very trusting for, uh, you know, strangers. <laughs> Oh, typing skills. Typing skills. Oh, what am I supposed to do? Kick her face. Run away. Q Q Q Q E E Oh No Take the hammer 
It's hammer time! I try to do as few hits as possible. You don't really want to show too much to a little girl. Man. Hi there. Clementine just saved my life. Did you kill it? Yes. Yes. It's okay. I think she was a monster. I think you'd be right, yeah, Clementine. I think so, too. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah. I want my parents to come home now. I think that might be a little while. Alright, now to tell yeah. her the truth or not. Oh. Look, I don't know what happened. But I'll look after you until then. What should we do now? We should look for we help before it gets find dark. Help before it gets dark. Yeah, it's not safe at night. Nope, I would not go around at night. Zombies don't really care. Stay close to me. But uh, humans are a lot better in the daytime. You know, I kind of wish I could go back in the kitchen, maybe sca you know, scavenge some things. I didn't really get a chance. Never getting home to mama at this rate. This sucks. Oh, it's hot dish night. All right. Well, we gotta go talk to them. Yeah. What's the matter? Should I stay? What? I don't want to sleep in the treehouse tonight, but I don't know if I should leave. That sucks. What if my parents she had to be there home? alone. I won't leave you alone. Well, let's go somewhere safe that's close, okay? That's a good idea. Hey, man! Holy shit! Don't eat us! We're not gonna hurt you. Yeah. Thought for a second you and the little one were both gonna give us the chomp. We're looking we need for help. help. Are you trying to get out of here? Because you should be. Those things are all over the damn place. I haven't seen anything as gnarly as this neighborhood since downtown Atlanta, 15 miles back. I'm Sean. Sean Green. Lee, this is Clementine. I'm Chet. We shouldn't be out in the open like this. How about you help us clear the way, and we'll take you and your daughter out of here and down to my family's farm. It should be safer there. I'm not a dad. I'm... Just some guy. Some guy? Yeah. She's alone? Let's get going. Staying put for too long is a mistake. Being truthful is probably better in the long run. What do you want to do? You don't want to make stuff up. I... The monster's coming. We gotta go. Leave quick. Let's go. Her address is 5240. <laughs> Come on, zombies in the way. For just some guy, seems like you saved a bunch of lives today. Yeah, lying's not a good idea. Uh, especially when you're trying to gain someone's trust here. The 
moon's nice. It makes the night really bright. Maybe a little bit more peaceful for them. And the farm's probably a better place to be than the big cities where there's lots of people. So it should be a lot safer here. Notice I didn't say safe. I said safe. <laughs> this is a zombie apocalypse. We're probably all... Honestly, in a real zombie apocalypse, you probably all die. Which, which is really hey, sad zombie. and morbid, but it's, it's probably true. Home. My mom was going to be in a state. Good thing there's no such thing as a You're real sweating, zombie man. apocalypse. I'll catch you tomorrow night. It was nice to meet you both. I'm just some guy. Not her neighbor. Not her parent. Just some guy. Thank God you're okay. I was wearing it'd be bad here, too. Been quiet as usual the past couple days. Well, breaking down the way, thinks his mare's gone lame, but that ain't nothing new. I wouldn't have made it back without Chet. Well, I'm glad you took him with you, then. You've brought a couple guests. Your boy's a lifesaver. We need a place to stay. Your boy's a lifesaver. Glad he could be a help to somebody. So, it's just you and your daughter, then? Oh, not his daughter. He's, well, just some guy who found her alone. Honey, do you know this man? Yes. Okay, then. Well, looks like you hurt your leg pretty bad there. Uh, yeah, it's not doing so good. I can help you out. Sean, run on in and check on your sister. You take a seat up on the porch and I'll go see what I have. So Clementine kind of lied for you. Let's have a look. Yeah, this is swollen to hell. Could be worse. Could be worse. That's what it sounds like. Seems like things got awful bad in the cities. What did you say your name was? It's Lee. It's Lee. Nice to meet you, Lee. I'm Herschel Green. How'd this happen? Car accident. That's so. Where are you headed? Before the car accident. Or the car accident. I was getting out of Atlanta. The news says stay. Yeah, well, that's a mistake. We hit a guy. One of those things you've been hearing about. On the road. Who are you with, the girl? I asked you a question. You said we. That's all. I was just making conversation. House is full up with mine. We got another displaced family of three sleeping in the barn. Man, I wish I could have uh, reacted a lot quicker to that. I didn't catch your name, darling. Clem Clementine. Can't imagine what you've been through, Clementine. I'm looking after her until we uh, find her parents. Hey, Dad. So I'm thinking, first thing tomorrow, we got to reinforce the fence around the farm. That doesn't seem necessary. I don't know what you saw on TV or heard on the radio, but there's some serious shit hitting the fan. I don't think anyone knows how big it is yet. Your this son's right. right. You're gonna want to fortify this place. Stuff like that doesn't happen around here, Sean. Dad, I'm serious. Lee, come on. Tell him what you saw out there, man. I got chased by a couple of dead people. Well, do what you think you should. We got plenty of chores as it is. Lee and those folks in the barn can help out in the morning. We gotta do it. Really. I already said okay. Well, I'm all done here. It should start to feel better tomorrow. Thanks. It's a lot nicer, all right. hot or the swelling doesn't go down, you're probably dealing with an infection. What do we do then? We'll probably just have to shoot you. We'll clean it, redress it, and you'll be fine. Okay, that'd be preferable. <laughs> There's blankets and such in the barn. We'll be seeing you bright and early. Come tomorrow, which way you think you're headed? Towards making, I suppose. All right, then. It smells like... Like poop. It's a barn. I 